Hi, I'm Michael Biggs, the Great Guy for OntarioWineReview.com, and today we're going to visit a winery whose 2010 Chardonnays have been some of my favorites. And let me tell you, I have liked every single 2010 Chardonnay that has walked out the door from Chateau de Charme. And today we're going to look at their 2010 St. David Bench Vineyard Chardonnay. This is a lovely bottle of wine, I'm telling you. It's $6 more than the barrel fermented version. And my thought here is, hey, what's $6 between friends and a good bottle of Chardonnay? It's got so much going for it. It's got vanilla, buttery sensations. It's got caramelized peach. It's got baked apple. It's got some really lovely acidity on the back palate, and that just helps bring everything all together. There's also hints of clove, maybe some burnt vanilla, but that's not a bad thing. It's incredibly tasty, incredibly mouth-filling. It's definitely worth picking up a bottle, if not two or three, because it's not that expensive. A lot of people say to me, Oi, what do you serve with Chardonnay? This one, I think I drink all by its lonesome. It's 1995, and it's the Chateau de Charme 2010 St. David's Bench Vineyard Chardonnay. And I give it 89 points. I'm Michael Pinkus, the Great Guy for OntarioWineReview.com. Join me again next week when we'll look at another great bottle of Ontario wine.